before this video starts, I just wanted to show you setup because this is this is some next level shit. You have light one, light two, a huge tripod, and a camera over here and you have this foil thing uh, that is hanging out on piece of uh, block and of course this uh, behind me is same as always so i wanted just to share that and uh, that will be my before the video sequence My name is Luke and welcome to the InstaLuke channel. What's up people? How y'all doing? I am great and that's not because we are going to save money in this video, but I'm also happy to start making a bit better videos for you guys now. I don't want to talk too much in this intro, so I will explain you guys what this video is going to be about. A few days ago I was looking at my video ideas list and since I have a lot of ideas, like really a lot. So, simple solution, just pick one out. Nope. I decided that I wanted to get that spin the wheel thing and uh, choose videos that way. Naturally, I went to Amazon and prices are way bigger than they should have been. Then I was like, bitch, I can make that for five bucks, DIY style. And there you go. It's that entire story behind this video. Intense, I know. So now that you guys know what am I going to... <sighs> Zoinks! You might be thinking... Oh, you should probably look up some methods on the internet before you start. No. This is going to be my own DIY. I haven't looked anything up on the internet. Even though I probably should have. But I can do this. Let's go. First thing first, I need to start getting materials. Here is the list, I have created it before the video and there are just few things that I need. Number one, cardboard. But before I do that, I want to eat a healthy snack. So here's the time lapse. Okay, as I was saying, I need a piece of cardboard and I think I have it somewhere around here. In this room, as you can see, I have everything and there are a few boxes. So this one is empty, but I don't know, is this big enough? I don't know. I also have this out of my laptop and this one looks a bit bigger, but it's not that much of a difference. These boxes are filled and I don't want to deal with that. So yeah, I think this one will do the job. It's good enough. Number two are barbecue grill sticks. Uh, those long ones. I don't know, do you guys know what am I talking about? But I think I have them somewhere in here. No, no. Oh my God, it's not here. I think I need to buy them. Okay, let's go. Okay, we're here. Okay, I'm done, let's go home. Okay, I just came back home from shopping and I realized that number three is fidget spinner. And I also need to buy that in town. So here we go again. I'm here, part two. I have been looking for that fidget spinner for 
too long. As you can see, it's dark outside. But I think I came to even better idea than I had with a fidget spinner and I am going to tell you about it in a minute. Okay, it seems that I kinda can't find it. And in that moment, I finally found it. Right here in this corner, I have found few empty CDs. And number four, some random accessories that you need in every DIY. <laughs> So now everything is ready and I need to create some kind of setup so I can record this video. Yes, these still exist. Okay, so this is the setup. I am, I am going to walk you through the basic idea of this project. I will first make a round shape out of this cardboard then we are going to stick that cardboard with, with these barbecue sticks and then we are going to put a CD uh, so we can spin it and choose our next video. So, let's begin. Okay, how should I start? Let's start with this. We need to make something that looks like a circle. <music> This is really more difficult than it looks. Finally! Now we need to make circle out of this. I should probably first uh, draw a circle. This is actually pretty accurate. Oh my god, I think I have a feeling that I will mess something up. I knew this was gonna happen, look at this part, it's so ugly, but what can you expect, I, I made it, oh shit. So next part we need to make a handle for this uh, thing to stay on, and take out four of these and glue them together. So I have a, hopefully a glue here, it looks like a glue, there is something go going out of this, but I don't know what. My hands are sticky, I don't know is that a good sign. These sticks are stuck together, but I don't know are they going to stay that way when I use them for other things. I don't think this uh, glue is strong enough. I will use a tape just to secure them. It is so hard to do anything when um, you're hands are sticky as hell and now I need to go clean up now I am going to divide this uh, circle in few pieces like I think 8 in one week is just enough like if I have 8 ideas that I can choose from here we go and then we can let's break this and let's put this through and I think that is it. So at this point I think that my idea is pretty clear. You spin this and uh, wherever it lands I will create an arrow like up here and wherever it lands I will do that episode. So as you guys can see my idea and my DIY is success. So as you guys can see this is the final product Okay guys, so I know that this has been a bit long video and a bit strange one. It was fun to try something new, something different and this was kind of just fun little experiment. I will be using this spin the wheel thing in my other videos. I am going to 
use it probably in the next one so if you want to see that press that subscribe button and bell icon to be notified every time i upload the new video uh, like this video if you enjoyed it and comment down below uh, have you made it uh, are you going to try it and things like that i am going to leave you links in the description if you don't want to go through this process and if you want to buy it go buy it I will see you guys soon with another video.